Minister of Public Utilities Marvin Gonzalez says the Water and Sewage Authority is taking a proactive approach in combating illegal water trucking scams. The minister says WASA is strengthening its enforcement and ensuring compliance with the WASA Act. He also notes that the $750 fine associated with the illegal extraction, distribution and sale of WASA's water must be reviewed. There is no doubt that this fine is outdated and obsolete. And with the fraction of time, it no longer serves as a deterrent to these serious acts or wrongdoing. The Water and Sewage Authority is currently undertaking, Mr. President, a comprehensive review of the act that governs its operation, including fines for various illegal practices that endanger or undermine the ability of the authority to provide services to the citizens of Trinidad and Tobago. The Public Utilities Minister was responding to oral questions in the Senate.